guys have seen these before, right? Once or twice. All right. What is it? <laughs> All right, he's ready for us. All right, it's the 2007 Tempe Music Festival. I'm Thomas Bond here with Richard and Jerry from OAR. Say hello to the people. Hey, guys, how hello. you doing? Tell us what you do in the band. Um, I play guitar. And I play saxophone. And you play guitar. And guitar. Don't be, don't be, don't be bashful. Yeah, don't be don't shy be about humble. sharing you your play talents. Drums. He's got the multi-talents. Yeah. And the flugelhorn. I diversify. <laughs> It's beautiful. Well, tell me about you guys going from uh, starting out at Ohio State University and, you know, lots of guys play in bands in college, but you guys have taken that college band and made a career out of it now. Yeah, you know, actually, the band even started before we went to college. Is that right? In yeah, the, the four other guys, Richie and the three other guys, uh, grew up in Rockville, Maryland. They played in high school together and uh, went to Ohio State University. That's where I met them. We played everything and anything around Ohio and, and to be honest with you here in, uh, in you know in the Phoenix Tempe area as well uh, one of our friends who's actually here with us today brought us out in like 99 was well, it? he graduated high school one year ahead of us so uh -huh. when we were back in, in high school he was asking for CDs to take out to uh, University of Arizona in Tucson right and so um, he would take like five or ten and then after a while he was like we need 20, 30, 40, 50, 100. People started asking for them. People started buying them. And right. then pretty soon we were getting flown out to play Tucson before we ever played a show at Ohio State. Wow, So that's in awesome. a way this is kind of, you know, where we first kind of got our Nice our, little our uh, fan wet. base building in Arizona. Right. Yeah, but you know, we started, awesome. started in Ohio and just kind of worked our way around. And, you know, 10 years later, here we are still oh, doing totally. it. totally. I mean, as you a know. band that had the total grassroots approach, I mean, you guys are the model for that. Yeah, you know, we just put our feet to the pavement and just kept going. Tell me about uh, the latest album, um, Stories of a Stranger. Yeah. What are you doing to promote that? How's it all going? It's going It's going really, really well. Uh, we have uh, our first single off that record, Love of Memories, just hit, I think, like 50,000 spins. I mean, nice. which, is, which is a huge amount uh, for a band like us and really anybody, you know, to get a good start at radio. So we're really excited and happy about that. Uh, the record, you know, uh, for us, uh, you know, it was a really defining moment in our career. We're extremely proud of that record. Very pleased with how it came out. Uh, opened a lot of doors at radio, opened the eyes and ears to a lot of different fans for us. So we're really excited about that. And, and now, you know, we're moving on and we're working on a new, a, a new studio record that we're going to start recording in the fall. And uh, we actually have a live record in uh, DVD coming out as yeah, well. Live from Madison Square Garden. Yeah, right? we played yes. uh, in January. We played Madison Square Garden, and uh, we filmed it. That's awesome. Recorded man. it. I mean, every yeah. band wants to say they played Madison it's, Square Garden. So congratulations. Know, yeah, it's 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 the cherry. You know, I and mean? we we've done that, and it's fantastic. It's really probably the best piece of work we've ever done, and it's coming it's out. It's in also June. our first full length DVD. And yeah, we, we've always wanted to do something like that. We just couldn't really find the right moment and. You know, uh, we played it last year, and like we decided if we do it this year, then we should definitely shoot a DVD. Right. So what what better way to come out with your first DVD than live from right. Madison Square Garden? Right. Now, when yeah. did you say that's going to be released? That's going to be out in uh, I think beginning of June is what we're looking at right now. And you're doing pre-orders through the website right now, right? Pre-orders right now, and uh, we're going to have some really really great special events uh, surrounding it. I think up in New York and maybe some other places as well. Uh, first part of June, so. Uh, we're just putting the finishing touches on it right now. We're extremely proud of it. It, it really came out great. Very nice. Now, I know uh, with the Grateful Dead not touring and Fish not touring, a lot of people have sort of pegged you as the next band that's going to take up this mantle. Have you heard about <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Obviously, you've heard that, but what's your impression of that? Is that something that, that you accept, that comparison to those other bands, or is that something that you really don't care about? I think, you know, when we get compared... You, the, the, the whole jam band category, which sometimes we get lumped into. Yes. Um, I think in order to, to be a jam band, you know, in, in my eyes, I think they're really talented musicians to be able to carry, um, you know, just the musical force they have on stage. Yeah, and improvise and all that. Right, right. And and for people to say that we're part of that, I think it's, you know, we're flattered. You know, we, we don't shun from that. Um, but at the same time, you know, we also, um, you know, we try to, you know, write songs in and, and not always jam out all the time, but you know, yeah. only when it's necessary. And 
you know, in our live show, that's basically what we save all that for is, sure. is, is expanding our songs. So. Yeah, and that's something different that a lot of the jam bands aren't known for. They're known for being great musicians, but not so much for the songs. Right, right, right. And you guys obviously have some, you know, catchy melodies and good right. songs working in your favor. Right. So maybe you straddle that line a little yeah, bit. Yeah, we're trying to have the best of both worlds, you know. Best of both worlds, a Van Halen fan. <laughs> Very nice. Hey, well, what haven't I asked you about uh, that maybe you want to mention for the folks here on camera? I don't know. Well, we're going out, going out on tour. This is actually the first show of our, our spring tour. And How long has it been since you played a show? It's been uh, what? Well, a couple little things here the and there. No, we're, not the garden. Uh, the Langarado Festival. Yeah, we're down in Florida. In Florida, we were there for a little bit. Nice. So you got to shake off the rust a little bit backstage little, before you go bit. on. No, we have a, good, a little bit. We're gonna have a good time tonight. <laughs> we're gonna, you know, we've been in this, we've been in the studio writing and recording music for the uh, in preparation for the next record. Uh, in, in February and March here, so you know we've been playing as a band. You know, though we haven't been out on tour, we've been playing a lot. Right. Uh, uh, this past couple of months, and yeah, well, you we're, guys are we're really uh, flooding the market with product. You got the latest album, now the live DVD, and then you're already working on the new studio album. You say yeah. you start recording in the fall. When are you yeah. planning on releasing it? You know, that, that's a good question. We're not really, we're not really at that point where we have a, we have a release date right now. You know, it, that, that's been the really great part about working on this last record is we literally started writing for it. Uh, a couple days after we finished Stories of a Stranger. So nice. we're just taking our time and, and really making the record right and making the record that we want to make. And uh, when it's done, it's done, and that's when we'll release it, you know. So uh, the DVD and the CD uh, that we're putting out in J uh, June really allows us a lot of time. Is it a live DVD time. and CD yeah, that goes with two, it? It's gonna Double be package. Yeah. It's going to be two pieces. So Released it's be a, together as one package? No, it's going to be two separate pieces. Okay. It's going to be a, a double disc live record and, and a double disc DVD as well. Oh, nice. But it's a record, it's the recording of the same show, yes, the Madison same Square show. Garden show. All right, well, fans will have to look for that. A live double DVD and a live double CD coming up in June from OAR. Tell me about performing tonight. Are you going to be uh, showing off any of those new compositions, or is it strictly... Uh, I don't know. Material we, that you've already played before. We usually tonight. write the set list a few moments before we go on stage, so that's uh, good. We'll, we'll keep find it spontaneous. Yeah, yeah. Figure it out in about four hours. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they look nice and fresh. They're ready to rock the stage to Tempe Music Festival 2007 OAR. Thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thanks, man.